Is it possible that just a plane crash could have collapsed these buildings? Or would it have required the sort of prior positioning of other explosives in the building? What do you think? No, I, I, my, my sense is that uh, just one, the velocity of the plane and the fact that there were, you have a plane filled with fuel hitting that building. And I think it was uh, simply the, uh, the planes hitting the buildings and, and causing the collapse. Where did you come from, baby? Reminiscent of those pictures we've all seen, uh, a building was deliberately destroyed by the old place dynamite to knock it down. This is the first time that we're aware of that a building over 15 stories tall has collapsed primarily due to fire. We did not find any evidence that explosives were used for the collapse of Building 7. Where did you come from, Angel? How did you know I'll be the one? Did you know you're everything I prayed for? Did you know every night and day for? Steel structural frame buildings, high-rise buildings, simply do not collapse due to fire. There has never been until 9-11 an experience where a high-rise building that was steel frame completely collapsed. Even one collapse, progressive global collapse, as they call it, would have been uh, extraordinary. But to have three occur in, in one day uh, was just beyond comprehension. This fused element of, of steel, molten steel, and concrete, and... You'd get down below and you'd see molten steel, molten steel running down the channel rails, like you're in a foundry. In an office fire, you cannot generate enough heat to melt steel. And yet we have evidence of molten iron. They basically concluded that there was no evidence of explosives in the debris, even though they did not test for it. That is the most unscientific thing that you can possibly think of, not to look because you don't expect to find evidence, and in fact the evidence is overwhelming. Keep on Keep on loving me, baby.